Hey everybody, it's Shannon here. I'm hoping that you're enjoying the first week of your new year. And uh, the day has finally come when I can afford two boxes of halves. Hello! I don't know that I'm going to be able to get it all in one video. Because um, my, my videos tend to run like 15-20 minutes anyways. Um, but if, if the boxes are good, then it's going to be a long video. Um, but if they're super good, then I'll probably have to break this up into two videos. So... I'm going to eeny, meeny, miny, mo, and we're going to pick one, and we're going to go with it. Wish me luck. Thank you for watching. I'll see you in a couple of seconds when I find something good. All right, here goes the unveiling of the very top, and guess what? We already have silver. Look at that. We got a silver ender, 1969. Boom. That's what I'm talking about. That is awesome. I think that's like possibly my first silver ender that is amazing i'm gonna go ahead and check out the rest of these see if there's any other good enders and i will loop you back in when i start hunting the rolls okay i didn't see any other enders but i am gonna put this right back where it came from and we'll get to it when we get to it hopefully it's got some friends on the inside and hopefully the rest of these rolls have some friends on the inside but i will holler at you if i find anything good See you in a couple of seconds, because I think I'm going to have a good box. We'll see. All right. We'll see you in a minute. Very first roll. What did I tell you? I think this is going to be a good box. Now, I am pretty sure that's a silver. It's um, If it is a silver, it's 40%. But I'm pretty sure that's a silver right there. So, let's get into it the rest of the way. Yeah, 1968. All right, two confirmed silvers in this box, and this is the very first roll. I mean, you cannot get mad at that. Let's see if I'll focus here. Focus. 1968. Gee, gotta love it. It's in really good shape, too. Hopefully, there's a whole lot more where that came from, but we'll take it. Definitely two on the board, one out of the rolls already, one out of the box already. We'll see what happens with the rest of this. This is shaping up to be the best one of the entire collection of boxes that I have searched. Because we already have another silver and we are on the second roll. So that's two for two. Let's see what it is. It's probably a 40, could be a 90, but it's definitely a Kennedy. It's a 40, 1967. Heck yeah. Oh my goodness, this is going to be an awesome day. Awesome box. Keep the silver coming. This is awesome. All right, I'll bring you guys back when I find something else. This is going to be a cherry box, I swear. We have one in here that looks like it's either dirty or silver. I'm going with dirty because I can kind of see some copper. But there's another one that's gold. Let's see what happens. A silver Seeker just pulled a gold-plated silver Walking Liberty. And this is, oh, this is terrible. But it is a gold-plated. It's just in really rough shape. But I think that's still super groovy cool. So I'm going to keep it. Put that right over there. And let's check out this dirty one that's probably not silver. Nope, Bicentennial. Just a dirty, crusty Bicentennial. And we got a shiny one here. What's the shiny one? Hmm. 79. All right. False alarm on that one. But you know what? Not bad. We're on roll number four. And we've already found a gold plated and two silvers confirmed and a third silver waiting to be unrolled. All right. I'll bring you back in a couple of minutes. And since I have it out, I might as well show you the curse of the dreaded half line. This is a uh, coin roll hunter in the area that is marking their coins. I've only found one so far and I've found three silvers and a gold plated so I don't think they hunted this. Uh, this must be a mix of all kinds of different locations or something but yeah okay I'll bring you back later. All right it's getting a little ridiculous it's awesome it's awesome. I think I have two silvers in this box in this roll I'm sorry I get excited and I mix up my words. <laughs> I'm sure you all are familiar with that. And probably do it yourselves too because it's easy to do when you get excited <laughs> all right we got a 1969 all right so far we got a 67 68 there's a 69 it's in good shape too wow not bad 
a little, little dirty, but not too bad. And this one right here is another 40%er, another 1969. Wow, this is awesome. This is going to be already, it's my best box. We're at five, five confirmed. And that was my max in my third box. I got uh, one in my first box, two in my second box, and five in my third box. And we're already at five, and it's my fourth box. Six rolls in. This is amazing. I can't believe what's happening right now. This is like one of those boxes that people dream of getting. It's pretty close, and we'll see what happens on the next few rolls. Okay, I wanted to do this one live because this is the one with the silver ender. And I wanted to see if there was any friends in there. So let's go ahead and crack her open. Ooh. Nope, no silver friends. But that's okay. We will take the silver ender. Oh, she's in good shape too. Not bad. 1969. We will take it. That makes three 69s. A 68 and a 67. Also found two 2018 NIFCs. Oops, let me get it in the camera view. Hello. Two 2018s. I think those are the newest NIFCs I've found. With this nice toner right there. Pretty cool. It's like red and brown and looks like somebody took some sandpaper to it. So I'll be throwing that back. Just wanted to show that to you guys. Then we got that gold plated one. See if there's anything else in here. I'm also saving a little pile of 73 and 74 D and 83 and 82 for, you know, you know, yeah. I'm going to check those later, but um, we'll see if we got anything else in here. paint red paint ooh red paint all over that's pretty cool but you know not not that cool oh there's a 2001 just a year away from an IFC <clears throat> this bicentennial has a nice gold tone to it I don't know if the camera can pick that up or not but you can kind of see it 74d Eighty-three and a 1979. All right, I will bring you back in if I find something else. Okay, I've officially broken my record from the last box. This will be silver number six, and I'm pretty sure it's silver. It looks like a 40. 90, 1968. Oh, I'm sorry, I get so excited. <laughs> silver number six on this box. This is amazing. Absolutely amazing. Put that one with the other ones and continue to search these boxes. I still have uh, 27 rolls left. So, I mean, we're still early on. All right, I'll bring it back if I find something else. This box is out of control. <laughs> All right, this is going to be silver number seven. And another 40 it's another 67 oh it's got some nice gold toning to it that's pretty wow <laughs> silver number seven are you kidding me this is amazing this is amazing i am so happy right now i'm ecstatic i'm gonna look at this thick rim roll while we're here 77 nothing that's it for that roll oh my goodness okay silver number seven Oh, wish me luck on the rest. We still have 26 rolls. Okay, guys. Down to the last roll. Haven't had any gold since, or silver since, uh, <laughs> haven't had any gold, you know. Haven't had any silver since, uh, about half a box ago. <laughs> and just going to do this one live for good luck. See if we have some last roll luck. No. No silver. That's another mark uh, that somebody has been doing. It looks like they took white out and just like made a line on the side of a roll and then threw them back into circulation. So they didn't check these well enough, I don't think, though, unless it's mixed with a bag of other stuff. There's another mark. I found a lot of those, but not as many as last time. It was a lot last time. It's like, I don't know, something like 60, 60 coins. 
Well, maybe even more. I didn't really count them. I just kind of guesstimated by looking at them. Another mark. Boom. Okay. Nothing in that last roll. All right. We've got empty box syndrome now, but we do have a backup. So I'm happy about that. Let me uh, let me do a little breakdown of what I got. I got a uh, let's see, pile of 74D, pile of 73D, a pile of 83 and 82D, and let's see, one, two three, four, five, six, seven silvers. Wow. That's amazing. That's my most to date from a box. Okay. So we've got this, uh, 71D I think is near perfect. It's definitely not seeing a whole lot of circulation at all. I'm probably the second or third person to ever touch it. I don't know. And I found another one just like it. So somebody definitely dumped a collection or a mint set of some kind. But I'm going to keep those out just because of how stunning they are. Found that gold plated and it's stamped. It says 1960, 1980. And uh, I've seen other people find these in, in circulation before. And, um, you know, they're, they're basically just a damaged coin. But I think they're kind of cool, so I'm going to keep it. Uh, I found this stunning... 2011 NIFC. It is so shiny. It's Delaware. Oh, De Delaware. I keep saying Delaware. That's stupid. Denver. Denver, Denver, Denver. This one is in really great shape. I mean, it's got some minor scuffs and tiny little scratches, but it is so brilliant. I kept it. And I found this uh, 1987D. Pretty nice. Not bad. A little bit dirty, but I'm sure that maybe a little soap and water will clean that right off. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten NIFCs, all different, all different dates. And I got this toner. And this guy, I don't know how he made it through the coin machine, man. If it was me and my at my bank putting that in the coin machine, that would spit that right back out at me, no doubt. The, I don't know how this made it through. This thing has been chewed up. Hardcore. So that one's going back. But yeah, uh, I'm going to go through these guys at a later time. We're at 13 minutes right now. I think that's good enough. And I think I'm going to save that box for tomorrow when I'm off. And it's supposed to be rainy. So, uh, thanks a lot for watching. Hope you guys are enjoying the new year. And a big shout out to... Uh, my ladies at the bank, uh, you guys, you guys know who you are. You're awesome. I really appreciate you helping me out and working with me. You guys just made my day. So I really appreciate it. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Um, and I will, uh, talk at you later when I do part two to the thousand dollar hunch. There it is. We'll see you later. See you later, guys. Thanks a lot. Bye.